Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to talk about SAS nodes. Actually, whenever we talk about log, we always look into nodes, warnings or errors. Mostly we are concerned with warnings or errors, but many a times we take it easy about SAS nodes. But some of the SAS nodes can be very, very useful to look into and we may have wrong information if we are not looking into our SAS nodes properly. So I'm going to make series of videos on SAS nodes. The first one is at least one W.D format was too small for the number to be printed. I'm going to talk about when we generally see this kind of notes and what it does and how we can fix it. And now let us look into what W.D format is. W is width, D is decimal in W.D format. And let's look into some examples to understand this. Here I am saying format 6.2 and then if I apply on 100.2 what it does is it displays 100.20 how can we understand this 6 is total width here if you see the width is 1 2 3 4 5 6 this includes the decimal and as we have said we want two decimals that is as I said the second part is decimal it displays us 100.20 even though we have the value of 100.2 because the format is one which displays the values the way we want and in here we wanted two decimals and the total width to be 6. Now what happens if you apply format 4.2 on 100.2 value. Now let's see what is happening in here it will display the value of 100 why is it displaying the value of 100 even though we have 100.2 because we have asked for format of 4.2 which means our width should be only 4 so we cannot display the whole thing because here to display the whole thing we need one 2, 3, 4, 5. The width should be minimum 5. So, this decimal we are not going to see because we have given the less width. Now, the same 100.2 value if I give format 2 dot, that is in this w dot d format, we are not telling anything about decimal, we are just telling about width. Here this value of 100.2 has a width of 5. There is no way we can use this small width to display this value because this has a width of 5 and if we use 2, two dot what will happen is it will not be able to display the whole thing and what really happens the back end is it will not show you the wrong numbers it will not just show you 10 if it is going to display 10 then it means the value itself is wrong even though it tries to adjust like in our earlier case 4.2 if you see the precision is missed by a little that is we are missing 0.2 but it is not going to show 100 as 10 so we will have star and star which means we are giving width of 2 so it will show 2 stars it's indirectly telling that it can't display this a value now let us quickly look into some examples wherein we can see this kind of nodes for that first i need to create a data set which i am doing by running this data step here and here the data set is created. After this, what I am trying to do is, I am trying to use a put function 
and I'm trying to create a character variable. In here, I'm saying it as C. And to do this, I'm using format. And in here, the format I'm using is four dot. And now let me quickly run this and see what is happening in here. Here, let's also look into the log. Here the log says at least one w.d format was too small for the number to be printed. Here you can see that all the values were transformed properly into the character variable. But what has happened in the case of the last value is it kind of tried to adjust to the format which we have given. The format we have given is Four dot. So what it tries to do or what it tried to do was try to adjust everything in four characters and in here that four characters are 56 E3. 56 E3 means 56 into 10 to the power of 3. So you can see in here SAS somehow tries to fix this problem and tries to give us some a result which makes sense but let's go ahead and make a little modification and let's try to drop the variable n now when i say drop equal to n and then i run this code once again when we do that what happens is we no longer have the variable n but the value of c becomes 56 e3 now we do not know what was the initial value in here so these are some problems we are going to see. So this kind of notes, we should never take it easy. We should try to figure it out and try to solve this problem. Let us look and see what way we can fix this problem. In here, whenever this kind of problem arises, it clearly tells us that we do not know much about our data. In here, what I can see is, I can see what is the largest value and then by understanding that largest value I can approximate or rather I would say I can adjust my format. In here the largest value is 55987. So what I can simply do is I can increase my format width and I can say it is 5 because now I know this is the largest value and it has width of 5. Now in here once I run this it shows our results properly. Now let's go back or let's see one more example in here. Now again we do not know much of our data and in here I am using for the data set above the format one dot. Here if you see the data has 5 as a width, if I give 1 width, what will happen is we are going to have issues. And about this, I have shown you earlier. In here, if you see, the 55987 is converted as star. This is not what we really expect. But this is what we are seeing. So we have to be careful while transforming numeric variable into character variable and we should try to give appropriate format. And now I also want you to again quickly look into our node. There is this node present. So we have to be careful with this node. And here I can simply increase the width by 5 and this will fix my issue. And also let's quickly look into the log. In the log you can see that there is nothing related to WD format node. The whole idea of making this video is to show the importance of log. It is always not important that we should have a warning or error and then only we will look into the log. Even we have to look into our nodes carefully and we have to see anything important that notes is trying to tell us that's all for this video if you have liked this video please like share and subscribe thank you